for this video, I'm gonna show you how to use a test light to test for power and ground. This is the test light I'm gonna use. The first thing you should do is get to know your tester. There's a tag on it. On the tag, it says use on 6 volt or 12 volt circuits only. This car have a 12 volt battery, so this tester could be used on this car. There's a light bulb inside the tester. As long as this clip gets ground and this probe gets power, the light bulb will light up. You do got to keep in mind that even if you get ground and power, if the bulb is burnt or broken, it's not going to light up. So first, I'm going to use this tester to test for power. First, I'm going to ground the clip to either a bolt or screw. I like to ground it to a bolt or screw. You don't need to, but this is my preference. I think it's the easiest. I'll ground it to this bolt. The clip is grounded, so if I could get power to the probe, the light bulb will light up. I got wire here. Obviously, this wire has no power. But let's say if I wanted to test if this wire has power or not, I'll touch the probe to it. The light bulb doesn't light up, so I know there's no power. But that positive battery terminal there, I know it got power, so if I touch it with the probe, the bulb will light up. I forgot to mention something. If you put it on like a bolt or screw and it's loose, then you might not get a good ground. If you don't get a good ground, then this test light is not going to light up. Or if you put it on a bolt or screw that's been painted over, it have paint over it. If you have, if there's paint over the screw or bolt, then you're not going to get a good ground either. If you don't want to clip the ground to a bolt or a screw, you could put it on something like this. This is for opening the hood. And then I should have a good ground there. Put the probe on the positive battery terminal. The light should come on. I just show you how to use a test light to test if a wire have power. Now I'm gonna show you how to use a test light to test if a wire is properly grounded. I installed this ground wire just for temporary. After the video, I'm gonna remove it. So let's say if I wanted to test this wire to see if it's properly grounded, I would just clip the tester to it, to the wire. 
The next thing I'm gonna do is touch the probe of the tester to something that has power. And I know the positive terminal of the battery. I know it has power. The way it works is if it's true, this wire is properly grounded. And if it's true, there is power on the positive terminal of the battery, then this light will come on. 